If you've ever been into a store where used CDs are sold, you know that occasionally you'll hear them playing something over the loudspeaker that is just completely ridiculous bullshit. Well, I went into this shop and they were playing techno. Nobody buys techno. Nobody plays techno unless it's in their headphones because some people have respect for other people. Well, you know what? They were playing techno here and I couldn't take it. So, I went up and was a nice guy about it. I didn't want to tell him to turn his bullshit off, so I just bought the CD off of him so that he would not have a copy to play anymore. I didn't think it was that big of a deal, but you know what? It started to bug the fuck out of me. Why is this guy playing techno in a self-respecting used CD store? Is this the only copy you guys have? How bad of a CD, Daryl? Horrible. Horrible. I didn't just leave the shop after that happened. I went back and went about my business and started the shop for the used CDs that I want. I thought it'd be pretty funny to buy a Nickelback CD since a lot of people in CD stores have contempt for Nickelback so that I could buy it and then say, I've been waiting a long time for this one. I love Nickelback. I need to buy some Nickelback. <laughs> All right, we're good, we're good. Okay. Or we still keep it under wraps. I did end up buying a Nickelback CD while I was there. I found Silver Side up. And the piece that I kept from the CD I broke is right here, so they can't reassemble it again. And I just wanted to say that even if I had gone in there and they were playing uh, Rage Against the Machine, I would have bought the CD and broke it. Because that's why I went there in the first place. Just so that I could be a royal dick. Although I'm glad it was something that I wound up hating. Because, man, that shit was awful.